When you're talking about the greatest spin bowlers that ever lived, Shane Warne he has to come right at the very top of the list. I personally think he's the greatest. Well, Shane Warne is a good friend, but certainly during the times facing him in the middle, he was far from it. Shane Warne single-handedly reinvigorated, reinvented the art of wrist spin bowling. That's bowling, that's good, clever bowling. You had a feeling that Daryl Cullen was after him, and Shane Warne has got the better of him. And that's an important wicket at an important time for Australia. He had all the variations of flipper, wrong and you name it. I think he had a new delivery every year. Yeah, I think if you were naming a World Eleven, the first name on my team sheet would be Shane Warne. You knew you were in a contest when you were up against Warney. I mean, his record shows you that not many people managed to, to find a way to sort of get him out of his routine and his rhythm. With the field settings and the way he bowls and the way he tries to trap you, it's a mind game, complete mind game. He didn't let the pressure off, so it uh, didn't get many bad balls. Shane Warne was just phenomenal, and in all situations, he was the guy you had to watch. I think when, when you're watching Shane Warne, it, it was almost like watching sport at its purest level. Straight to slip. He's got in. Great little catch. Beautifully bowled by Shane Warne. This game is coming alive. I think he brought showbiz to the game. I thought he brought excitement and X Factor wherever he played the game. He played up to the crowd, he played up to the umpire, he tried to get into the batsman's mind. So Shane Warne really understood the circus of cricket and for about two decades he was its finest ringmaster. You had people walking into grounds uh, to watch people bat. I think Shane Warne was one such bowler who uh, demanded crowds to come in and watch him bowl. from Shane Warne, clipping the top of off stump. That's absolutely exactly what the Australians needed. And this is the perfect leg spinner. In drift, it pitches outside leg stump and hits the top of off. Also brings a little bit of fun and enjoyment off the field. I think that's all part and parcel of being a superstar. He played the game the right way. He was fun. Uh, he enjoyed talking on the field. He enjoyed it there afterwards. And to have Shane bowling at the other end was, uh, was an absolute privilege. He's a genuine guy with a big heart, um, a very caring personality. A tremendous competitor. His legacy, I think, has been unparalleled in the history of spin bowling.